so hi everyone so uh, this is a basic tutorial in which we'll understand how we can install python on our systems as well as uh, the jo python notebooks on which we'll be working throughout the projects so let me start with how we'll be going through all this and how we'll be uh, creating our projects so first of all uh, open the official website of python python.org/downloads and here you'll see the latest version of python that is available for you to download so kindly download this version of python on your systems and you will uh, get an exe file after your exe file you can uh, click on the next options to install that on your system there are various versions or like there are various uh, operating systems on which the version is available for example if you are using windows if you are using linux mac os or any other so it is uh, compatible with all these platforms after you, uh, python is installed on your system then you can open the command prompt just to check which version of python is uh, there on your system and you can also see its availability so when we click on python so here you can see that i can see it's python 3.7.3 that is installed on my system right so this is one thing now this command prompt acts as a python shell on which we can run python code but it is not interactive to make it more interact uh, to move on to an interactive version will be using your python notebook but uh, let me show you how this works so i'll be uh, simply uh, writing very simple code of printing hello world that is the most basic program of all the languages so here you can see it's hello world is written now i'll be giving values to the variables like a equal to 7 b equal to 8 then you click on a plus b it's it comes out to be 15 so this is a basic python shell but uh, like you might face some issues as well while uh, solving while uh, downloading python and it might not be there in your system so for those of you who are facing any issues like uh, go to this your my computer or this pc then move on to the properties tab we'll see upon the environmental variables that are available right so here move on to advanced system settings uh then click on environment variables here you can see the path you can see the path right so edit this path and as you can see that i already have uh, local then programs and python and python 30 732 scripts and local programs python so these files should not be missing if these files are missing then it can create a problem so you you have to uh, write like uh, copy and copy the same path and paste it here like if you click on edit like any option you can go to and click on edit and you can change your own path according to your own pc right so thank you so much this was all about installing python all the best